city is so ready to cheer our team on the victory. Yeah, certainly. These finals bring so much attention to our city that it's already seen the spotlight because of the RNC and other events. Five on your side, investigator Jonathan Walsh today talked one on one with the Cavs CEO. And JW, what did he say this means for Cleveland? Well, Len Komorowski has been through the 2007 finals last year, of course, this year. He says the stakes get higher every time we get to this point. Cavs CEO Len Komorowski told me today is a big day and a great day for the Cleveland Cavs and the city. Len explained the finals help accentuate the Midwest city that owner Dan Gilbert is championing. The same city that has fought its way back to now a prominent site for major events like the RNC. He told me Clevelanders now feel like it's our time, it's our city that will be a bright spot for the world to see. It wasn't necessarily that way back with the first finals during 2007. It is a totally different city. It is a totally different city, which now, whether it be Fodor's or the LA Times, New York Times, one of the top places to visit, we're on that list. You know, so I think for all Clevelanders, you know, it's now about expecting what, uh, we're expecting good things to come versus waiting for the shoe to drop. Well, everybody down here, very anxious, very excited about this game tonight. Coming up at 5 o'clock, you're going to hear more of my interview with Len about this kind of soup of activity and events going on all coming together. And you're going to find out what he says is the cherry on top for both Cleveland and Northeast Ohio. We'll see you live on 5. I'm investigator Jonathan Walsh for The Now.